welcome to the first tutorial of ESG201 lab introduction to electronics. I am Shivendra, your tutor for ESG201 lab course this semester. Today I am going to show you from where you can download the microcap software and how to install it. Microcap is a SPICE compatible analog digital circuit simulator. A circuit simulator is a computer program used to predict the behavior of an electrical circuit under different operating conditions. For downloading, go to your web browser and search for microcap and then open spectrum-soft.com link. Go to the download section and here you can see there are different microcap versions. For easy installation, you can download the full CD of the latest version, which is microcap 12.0.5. Click on the CD. This will start start the download. I have already downloaded it, so I am going to cancel it. And now, as we have installation file, so let's go for the installation. So unzip it, uh, extract all, and it will extract the file. I have already done it. So go to this extracted folder and execute setup.exe file. So just click on the next and look for the destination folder where you want to install the microcap. Make sure that you are installing to a non write protected folder and click on the next type your username so i'm typing my name shivin and you can also type your company name or you can leave it blank too click on the next few more times and check mark the 32 bit or 64 bit version you can check mark both also and you can check mark to be a desktop icon and the start menu if you wish. Click on next and next. This will start the installation. Now we have microcap installed in our system. Hit on the finish. This will open the microcap GUI. This is saying that do you want to exit the microcap and please exit microcap and rerun from the start menu. So I'm going to exit and then going to open the microcap from start menu and close all these welcome notice and I'm going to close it and this is our GUI of microcap and now we have installed successfully installed the microcap thank you for the watching we will see the details about GUI and how to make schematic and done simulations in next video.